Be to the left in the red, you are. I'm Deanne Ford. Lady to the right in black. I am confused. <laughs> <laughs> I know, but right. Right. Yeah, it'll be his right. Yeah, his right. His left art, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Just, just say introduce yourself. Korean. Okay. Uh, that works. Yes. All right. So. BFF. Okay. Yes. Our BFFs. Okay. So we're going to sit and we're going to question both of you guys on your friendship. Okay. So first question. Uh, when I'm lying to someone, like if I tell a guy I'm from Africa, all lies. Right. right. Or yeah. if you know it's a lie, just let the lie marinate. We'll I'm not able to do that sin. Yeah, we'll, talk, we'll do a side chat. You always <laughs> expose me in front of the wrong people. Have you embarrassed me? Embarrassing moment. Yeah, I see. I can't think of anything right now off the top of my head. You embarrass me normally because you just say off the wall things. Oh wow! You're very, very, very quick with your mouth. Mm. But it's never you, you want to give an example? Yeah, you want to give an example just to, so I know? No, not for you two. That would be oh. a different channel. Oh, okay. you know, you, you're just quick with the mouth. Oh, I, oh, oh my! Yes. I know you know something. Down embarrassing down. moment. Oh, now this, you know this. Yeah. So the most embarrassing moment was we were going out to the club one day. It yeah. was me and about like three, four of our other friends. And Deanne was being <laughs> dressed. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and she had her good shoes on and she was cutting a rug in the room. And then all of a sudden her heel went out and it broke and popped off her. <laughs> I remember that. I had that. And she was yeah. asking for super glue, which unfortunately I didn't have any. Right. So we do wear the same size shoes, but back those were our struggle days. So I only had one good pair of club shoes, and I had them on. And so she needed, she needed some shoes. The only other pair of shoes I had was church shoes. So she had, went to the club in the church shoes. Yes, and I had a and a jumpsuit. I had a jumper, and then I had two pigtails. Oh, I thought it was cute. No one told me to take them out. I remember that. Yeah, Victoria. Yeah. Okay, that's embarrassing. Nice. All right, next question. Okay. God, he's omnipotent. He's everywhere. That's who I look up to. Yeah. And that's what we have in common. Ooh. Feet. Mine says dying alone. I'm gonna be honest with you. I always be here. I know, but I'm talking about companionship, like, Going, going, like going on for the rest of my life, not having. But sometimes you, you get in a relationship and your spouse dies, so that doesn't mean that. I know, and that's what I'm afraid of. That that's another fear of mine too. Yeah, I don't know if I can handle. I just that. hope that you don't die feel feeling unloved. At least some particular time in your life, I would like for you to feel like really, yeah. really loved by a man. That's what I want you to to aspire. Okay, Karina. <laughs> don't cry, D. Sorry. Good thing you done, man. Oh, I know Deanne's answer. Oh, she laughs her way through things. She's done it all of her life. Yeah. She has always made things funny. That's her yeah. way of hiding her pain yeah. and things that hurt her. She laughs. Like she that's why she's such a funny person. That's true. It really is a genuine place, but it's usually her hiding something and that's how she but it also keeps her going because she's always laughing. Yeah. And then yours, I would say, ooh, well I can't say that. Did I laugh? Uh no, I was gonna, I was gonna <laughs> <laughs> like that. The trees. <laughs> if you if, they, if you've seen uh Have a card. Oh well, 
I can't say it though because it's advocating. Uh, have you ever seen Tales from the Hood? What do they come to the funeral home for? <laughs> that. The shit. Yes. That. The shh. The shh. Okay. Yeah. But am I wrong? Like, what, I mean, like, would that make you? I mean, I, I would say I hide things with my anger. Oh. That's usually how I keep people um, away from me is, you know, time, time. Oh, wow. And space. Okay. 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 Next question. Oh, let's see. Um, all-time favorite member. Do you have one, Karina? I don't know. Mm -hmm. I'm seeing you have so many good, funny memories. Yeah, all-time favorite. Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, I really don't know. I mean, <laughs> I remember so like the countdown. <laughs> like there's just so yeah, many where there's so many. Yeah, that um, comes to mind. Yeah, I don't have one. Mm. Without crying, let me just say that a fun like all time favorite memory. I guess trips. I haven't traveled. Mm -hmm. Every time you know, I don't have anyone that I go out of. Even going to a different city like Vegas or what Los Angeles. Mm -hmm. We've been in Chicago mm -hmm. like that. I've never done that. If I, if I didn't know you, I would not have done that on my own. No, Just traveling, true. yeah. Traveling for me is a favorite memory every time. Mm -hmm. Even with you, Donovan. Yeah. I do. I have regret. My biggest regret is putting these guys that I dated over you at the time with Anthony, Brian. Was there anyone else? I know the ones that I was seriously dating mm -hmm. to allow them to treat you like that because in the end, you were the one that were there for me when mm -hmm. they did things to me. So I think that was my biggest regret is placing men who were of no value over a friendship that was worth a lot. Does that make sense? I regret allowing the 50, 100th time being too much of me stepping away. I wish I would have been more... Even though I know I kept trying, I wish I would have probably kept trying even more. Because I think eventually I would have been able to get through it to you. But I've always told you, you do things on your own time. And either way it goes, I still be here. Yeah. Wow. But, that's, but there was time I would yeah. have to give us space. Because, you know, if that's yeah. what you choose to do, that's what you choose to do. And I have to support you from a distance. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. I remember those times. Oh, what's the lab? Mm. I know, I know yours. Who, who am I? Who am I? Be? RL. So RL will be yeah, I want him as my husband. Okay, <laughs> skip your best friend. Um, let's see, yours coming. I don't know. As a celebrity, a female and male. I see. You know, I don't I'm know. I'm so not celebrity. Yeah, I am. I'm starstruck at all. Right. You know, I'm the complete opposite. Like I've run away from. Yeah. Let's say, uh, hmm. I used to really like T.I. You did? See, I didn't know that. So we're learning about, <laughs> learning things as we go from T.I. Huh. I Female? Female, Beyonce. Beyonce, okay, that's a good She's one. She's my spirit. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, yeah. I, R.L. Huh, I don't know about who female. Who female? Yeah, um, you know who was, uh, that Paris? When she went to New England, she was asking people were they circumcised. I mean, <laughs> that is so me. Was her name Paris? Remember, she was loving hip hop. Yes. Atlanta? the one I stole yes. from Kate Michelle. Oh yes, her name. So, are you circumcised? That is something I would ask. I yes, guess. and that would be. That, when, remember when I was saying embarrassing moments? Yeah. And I said it's because you just say things. That yeah. would be an example of one of oh, those man. times I'd be in Paris with her, embarrassed. Not in Paris. Her, I think her name is Paris. Where did you say we would be? England? You said she was in England. She went to, wait, Paris went somewhere with them on a trip on Love and Hip Hop, Atlanta. And she was asking, she was asking men, I don't know where they were at, but she was asking them were they circumcised. That's not good. Yeah. <laughs> right? I know. That's something I would do. Yes. Definitely. All right, next question. Oh, sloppy dubs. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Now, you see, I don't know. Your palate is different than mine because you cook. Mm -hmm. So, I. Palate. Oh, see. 
There's things I'm learning as we go. I didn't know water. That. You like salad fruit? I love salad. I did not know that. What type of salad? I like like a good spinach salad, mm. and I like good bowls too. Cause I like okay. quinoa, and I like corn in my salad. And wow. I like, uh, eggs. I did not know that. So a Caesar salad, chicken. I love Caesar salad. Mm. Good shrimp. Good okay. shrimp. Okay. See, I didn't I know that. So shrimp. I'm learning. Wow. I love salads. Okay. That's interesting. That's a good question. Dog. Dog. Yeah. That's easy. Yeah. No, we don't pick cats. Yeah. Yeah, cats are not, not responsive. No. Yeah. Not gonna be able to do it. Right. Meow. What? Who's at the door? Meow. <laughs> 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 Wait. What? 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 What's going on? Meow. <laughs> okay. What would you do with the money? I would say you would have. Of course, you'll pay your bills, and then the rest you're spending your kids. You'll be the last person. You well, let me put it like this: that ten thousand dollars will be spent on everyone else but yourself. Correct. You you buy wigs. She's telling the truth. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to say that. Yes. Fashion Nova. I would if I could still fit it. Amazon. Mm-hmm. Um, would. that would be it. You like wigs? Oh, makeup. Yeah, I think I would. Eyelashes. Yes. Oh, yeah, I would. You're, yeah, you're actually right. Yeah, you'd right. probably get, like, yeah, if you knew it wouldn't hurt, you would get your eyebrows in it. Oh, uh, probably not. I still, I think you I'll be scared. scared. Yeah. Yeah. I think I'll take a risk and draw them on. Every day's a different <laughs> shape. Yeah. Every day's a different Filling shape. in different colors. Right. Yeah. I would. That's yeah. Convenient. Yes. Good answer. Hmm. Sloppy Joe's. Sloppy Joe. Yours. See, it's different because she makes real meals. She'll do a sloppy joe with. No, I'm saying yours with sloppy joe. I know, I'm saying with like, I, it, like I do a sloppy joe with maybe sweet potato fries or like chips, but mm -hmm. you, do make, you make. your sweet potato fries? Yeah. I like do. I don't know. No, no, oh, no, no, no. They, they come in a bag. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Mm -hmm. I'm late. I thought you got the oh, no. vegetables. Mm -hmm. No, what I'm saying Stop. is your meals, you could do like a spaghetti dish with chicken. You make different meals mm -hmm. like your your kids. We didn't grow up like that. Sloppy mm -hmm. Joe was the main dish, mm -hmm. the only dish. Mm -hmm. We didn't have no side chicks on the side. That was it. Yeah, I tell them that they don't understand. Yeah, so I wouldn't know how to answer that question because you can cook. Um, my go-to dish would probably be the jambalaya. My kids love it. But you make jambalaya and you make other things with it. I know yeah. you make cornbread. Yeah. And then I might make like yams. See. And mac. And I would have stopped the cornbread. That would have been it. Yeah. We. With the jambalaya? Yeah. I used to look like that. Yeah, see? Yeah. That's that's the most... A uh, guy knows I like him by making jambalaya. That's like the, my most fanciest meal. Jambalaya and cornbread. I think that meal right there is like, I love you. <laughs> you don't think so? You're the one. Yeah, you're the one. Yeah, I don't cook for everybody. Okay. So I, I mean, I've, I've done way more. Yeah. Dang. Can you imagine being with a woman who only made... Yeah, just, just, I know what I'm saying. Oh, you, yeah, yeah, just in general. One just one dish. Well, where's the rest of it? That's it, baby. I used to cook. Like that. I mean, it's a learning experience. When yeah. you get with a dude, you'll figure out how he likes to eat, and then you'll cook for him. Right. Yes. All right. Next question. I remember the first day we met. Yeah, I remember that day too. But when are so some of these questions I'm trying to figure out is it about us? Yeah. I guess it would be oh, a oh, question. Oh, because they're thinking we, we yeah. We met in the seventh grade, so do you remember how we met? Like honestly, you, you can't. Yes, okay. I remember being very because I'm a very quiet person. I don't really approach people. Okay, and I and you who are you. not correct. You are very open and talkative person, yes. and you came up to me and said, "You're black, I'm black. We should be friends." There you have it. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly how it happened. I don't know if we were on the same team. We were. We were on the same team. Wow, you remember? See, I don't remember none of that. Yeah, we was been on yeah. the same team this whole time. Yeah, and you can vouch. I had eyebrows in the seventh grade. You did, and I had. Edges. You started to shave them off. That's how. What in high school, right? Yeah. Oh man, remember that day, Kwanisha? <laughs> 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 oh, that might be one of the another most embarrassing <laughs> yeah. moments. Yeah. Deanne came to high school. She didn't have any eyebrows drawn on, and one day this girl turned around in class, and she was like. 
She gave me a pencil. She gave her a pencil like, here, please go to the bathroom. Right. Draw your eyebrows. Draw my on. eyebrows. I don't know why I did that. Yeah. <laughs> Emergency brows in what well, I don't know what grade I was in. Yeah. We was in high school. Yeah, I don't know. I was in ninth grade. That was embarrassing. We she, were in um uh, government or something. Yeah. It had to be like tenth grade. Yeah, I don't know. That was embarrassing. Okay. I would say your favorite oof holiday. I would say Thanksgiving because you cook. I could be wrong. I never cook for Thanksgiving. Oh, you know? I used to always be at my in laws. So holidays for me have really been different. But normally my favorite holiday is Christmas. Wow. Because I love to like decorate the house. Oh, okay. And, yeah. and I do cook on Christmas. My parents come over, they watch the kids open the gifts, I cook Christmas Eve. I usually make a big dinner, different thing every year. Hmm. Okay. Mine would be uh the day after Valentine's Day. You get uh, also the Well, that too, and that's when guys really hit me up, you know, the <laughs> side chick day. I will say Sweeter's Day in Chicago, but that is a real holiday, right? Sweeter's yes. Day? Sweetest. Sweetest day, yeah. That's not it. Valentine's. Yeah. Mm hmm It it is? It's the opposite. Mm hmm So sweetest day the women cater to the men. Ooh, that's a good one. I like that. That should be the Valentine's Day, the yeah. men are supposed to cater to the woman. That's yeah. how they see that. Mm hmm I did not know that. What, what my is... baby catered to me. Why? Three sixty five. Yeah, I don't know. Well, I don't what, know what why somebody <laughs> said sweetest day. Sweetest day he took me to dinner on sweetest day. <coughs> well, what what is it? It's in October. October, okay. Just a side note, okay. That would be All fun. right, next question. <laughs> Ooh. Dang, you can be honest too. It's not going to hurt me. We've, we've, went here. Your uh, mouth? Wow, you, you didn't have to think. <laughs> Wait, hold on. She was like, okay, that's one. The way you allow people to use you, mm. that's always bothered me with you. Okay. That's just your level of kind heartedness, though. I don't think it's from, oh, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I don't think it's like you're naive. I just think you're too nice sometimes. And people are undeserving of your niceness. Wow. And then you okay. don't see it until you get burnt. Yeah. And then you're like, you was right. They wasn't nice. Yeah. I, I, I have a couple, yeah. Yeah. A couple examples of that. Lots. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty 100% accurate. You can tell the one that I think you're going to tell. Just give them an example. That's what? two. Go ahead. I, I have one. I know one on top of my head. Which one? Do you when I got saying? fired from Walgreens. Oh well, that was that was that's something that people using yeah. you. Yeah, I thought yeah. That, that was crazy. That yeah. I told you not to let these people mm -hmm. go into your job that is not your friends, and you give them a hook up. When yeah. You don't ever talk to these people, and right. these people did not care when you lost your job. You got a whole fifty percent off hairstyle. Yeah, and it was terrible too. It was. It was. It was. And I got fired the day after New Year's Eve. New Year's Day. I remember that. They gave me the day off and I came and they fired me. So that's two. What's the third one? Um, sometimes you're naive. Oh, that's very but true. It's, Those are yeah, that's the yeah, way. My your said your that, fathers yeah. sheltered you a lot growing up. So I think that has a lot to do with it. Yeah. So I always have to be the street smart person in our relationship to make sure that we, we're safe. If not. <laughs> like when you told me not to go around Philly. Yeah, Philly. yeah. When you was gonna make a live <laughs> video in Philly, and right. as you're in the hood, yeah. I'm gonna be skipping down the street. Yeah, you gonna yeah. get stabbed down the street too. That's, That's not very safe. true. I don't know if I have any see pet peeves about you. I mean, we talked about that. Let my lies marinate going forward, all 2020 and 2021. Um, that's really it. I don't know if you ever lied. I think that can be pushy sometimes. Yeah, but I feel Persistent. like, well, I feel like it's because you want me to be a better person. Right. It's not something I would say that is uh, malice. It's like, you know, mm -hmm. I want to motivate you. Like, for instance, why are you 38 with a next spin car? Get you a real bank. Absolutely. I, I, can't, I can't, can't rent, rent a car. I can you tell her this all the time. Your okay. best friend, yeah. you're betting, but hold on. Yeah. Disclaimer. Your best friend works for a bank. Yeah. So I can help you get this checking account that I'm telling you to get because you're 38 with an ex bank. You have prepaid. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. So things like that. So no, I don't want to have too many pet peeves. No, just the, the lies in exposing me. Who, me? You too. Oh, traveling. Well, now, but before, where can you find me? At home. That's where I was at. Yeah. I don't go anywhere. In my bedroom. Just like the crash pad. Where do you find me? 
in the crash pad. In the crash pad. Yeah, not, yeah, not playing no games. Yeah. Minding my business. That's what I've yeah. been doing. You, I could always find her at home with her kids or with the man behind the camera. That's it. Yeah, that's mm, it. That's all. Oh, job. Yeah, we don't play by our jobs. Yeah. Oh, we, we stay employed. Yeah, we, yes. <laughs> right. Very true. Yes. Next question. I think, to me, your greatest accomplishment is your children. Correct. I put a lot of pride into my kids. Yeah. I would say yours is becoming a flight attendant. Yes! That is so true. Because you know I know I'm... how hard you struggled to yes. get it. And I know what you went through to get to that stage of life. Mm -hmm. So I know how hard it was for you to get through. She's right. Becoming a flight attendant, I know how proud of yourself that you are. So yes. Go, girl. Cool, cool. yeah. Yes. Well. COVID bump. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Um, ooh, your biggest disappointment. Let me see. Ooh, you know my biggest. What I feel like my biggest disappointment was. You could definitely say it. No, I, I don't. What if I say my something? My marriage. Okay. Yeah. Ooh, no, That's no, what I, you I say. yeah, I promise you. But I mean, it's not something that I expected to happen. So that yeah. that would be my biggest disappointment. I didn't want to say that. Then my second one was probably. Um, well, no, I can't say that. That wouldn't be a disappointment. I was like a junior. But he didn't do anything. Nah. Yeah, that wasn't disappointing. Yeah. Yeah. Nah. Oh, wow. He didn't, he didn't leave no residue yeah. in my life. At all. What, what about not finishing college? Yes. Those would be my two. Yeah. That could have been a bad Not part. finishing college means so close to the end. Mm -hmm. And, you know, my marriage not working out. Now, what are mine? What do you think mine would be? Because I know. I know why, and I think you know the one too. Um, disappointment. Mm-hmm. I mean, I'm pretty sure that stage of life that you experienced is not something you would have wanted to go through. Yeah, that was a disappointment. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we can't even talk about that. What's the What's the one you think that would be another one? There's been a couple. Yeah, I know you were disappointing yourself with your mom. Yeah, I was. I know you felt like you yeah. didn't take care of her. The way you would have wanted to after yeah. she passed. So yeah. I know that that was a disappointment you it had. Was. Mm -hmm. Um, I mean, probably being with these men. For yes, so long. yes. Lord, you are like, speaking to her tonight. <laughs> yes, because that that is a disappointment. Like Anthony, just, yes, so many years. A lot of years of your yes, life so many to years. have to take from you. So I'm pretty sure that those are right. two of your biggest disappointments with your mom and your relationships. Credit score drop, lost edges, and everything. 